Welcome back to Mr. S Travel Quest. Today we're at Mother Neff State Park. Come check it out. Considered the first Texas state park and just southwest of Waco, Texas. Daily entrance fee to this park is only $2 per person and children under 12 are free. We visited the Prairie Loop, which is under a mile. Difficulty is considered easy. Be on the lookout for Texas songbirds and pollinators along this trail. This is a family friendly walk. This trail has plenty of native grasses and wildflowers to view. Come on Peanut, we just started. Before we head off to the next point of interest, we wanted to check out the repurposed park. The park has closed the picnic and playground area due to safety concerns from COVID-19. This park is known to flood and they salvage and repurpose some of the wood for the playground. I thought that was pretty cool. Next we visit Point of Interest 5, Wash Pond Trail. This trail is well shaded, but watch out for roots and rocky terrain. Wash Pond Trail is just under half a mile and is considered a moderate challenge. Once you get to the pond, just sit back and relax. This is a CCC park and the workers expanded the natural dam to enlarge the pond you see today. We continued our hike on Wash Pond Trail and enjoyed the small streams and sounds of nature. Be careful, some parts of the trails were slippery and had uneven terrain. Peanut's asking, are we there yet? If a person in your party gets winded, take a rest. The point of interest two, three, and four are near each other. Points of interest three, CCC design picnic table, and here what remains. Local resources inspired its design. The stone picnic table blends into the surrounding landscape. Just a short hike, next we visit Tonkawa Cave. Imagine what life was like for the Tonkawa people who lived in this rock shelter over 200 years ago. The cave felt cool once you walked under it. I can see why the Tonkawa chose this as a shelter. If you didn't want to hike to see the cave, you can drive and park near the cave entrance. These stairs lead straight to the parking lot. We are back on the trail, headed to point of interest too. CCC Rock Tower, point of interest too. The Civilian Conservation Corps built the water tower in the 1930s. They added a spiral staircase and provides a high vantage point overlooking the surrounding area.
we headed back down and viewed a CCC cabin. You can actually rent this cabin when the park is under normal operation. We continued on Tower Trail. This bird blind is near the tower. The bird blind wasn't active on our visit, but maybe next time. We walked across a few benches on this trail. This park is great for families and beginning hikers. We enjoy this park and would recommend it to anyone who enjoys hiking. Our dog Peanut loved this park. We hope you enjoyed the video. Subscribe to our channel if you enjoy hiking and visiting state parks. We post videos like this all the time. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.